watching the first light from a ferry boat on the very beginning of my long journey. 3,000 miles. It's zero dark 30. <laughs> There's just the first beginning of light in the sky. I'm sitting here on the ferry having just said goodbye to my family. Kind of heartbroken. And at the same time, uh, I'm grateful that the work that's taking me away from them is work that I care about so much. And from a home family to a work family. I have an international border to cross. We'll make it through Washington and Idaho into Montana. I hear there's snow. <laughs> I'm from Hawaii. I'm not great at driving in snow. We'll see what happens next. Pit stop number one, provisions. Because you can't bring these from Canada or they get mad at you. Green juice and kombucha and health food and all kinds of hippie garbage that many people in my family would make fun of me for. I've made it this far to, where am I? I'm in Washington, just outside of Seattle. And now I'm going to be chomping my way cross country and I don't have to stop for anything with gas. The good news is I've already made it uh, three hours. The bad news is I'm already punchy. <sighs> we should start with where we are. We're, not, we're in Arleigh, Montana. I'm a Canadian and I'm from, from um, outside. I was born in Brampton. Without knowing you or anything about you, yes, showed up in your it. house with another Canadian. Like that. oh, that's yeah, really I'm cool. always excited. That's really cool. When Canada is, uh, the fur trade era has always been my passion, yeah. and I live on an Indian reservation. So what better place? What is family to you? It's community. It's how I mean. We don't have family. We don't have anything. Anybody that walks through my door, oh, is family. I mean, just just meeting you. I mean, it's like whoa. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. I feel really lucky to have been here. This is really cool. This is inside. I'll show you the outside in a minute. Um, this is all prayer flags. And I just think that's beautiful and it's a little cheesy too, but amazing. What if we all lived that way? Look at that big, beautiful pile. I wish for peace. I wish you peace today. We are in Montana. Uh, in the Garden of Thousand Buddhas. So this is a garden which is uh, set up by a reincarnated Tibetan Lama 20 years ago. Actually, I'm from Tibet, but I lived, studied in India, lived in Nepal for 20 years. Family can have uh, different kind of definitions to different people. I think family is the the basic kind of foundation of the society. It is the nucleus most important uh, part of the society. My family is in India right now. We have been refugees for the last over 60 years and refugees have to, we have to compromise ourselves. So I made it to Montana, where it is not snowing, as a matter of fact, the weather held. And this, it's less dramatic than it seems like it should be. This is the Continental Divide.